part C and D, we're looking at the range and interquartile range of our little stem and leaf plot here. So, in order to do this, we know that our range is equal to our highest value minus our lowest score. So for males, and we'll do females over here. For males, the, our highest score is going to be uh, 34. And our lowest score is going to be 6. So our range is going to be equal to 28. And for females, range is going to be equal to their highest score which is 35 less their lowest score which is equal to 9 and this is going to be equal to 26 for interquartile range we know that our median was our eighth value median or Q2 is equal to our eighth value which essentially split uh, the 15 data points into two so we had our one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen data points and uh, our median is here. So what's left is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So our quartile 3 is going to be the middle of these 7 points. So if we find to find the middle of the 7 points, we know that it's odd. Uh, so let's do the first ones down here. So 1 to 7, we find the median of essentially these. this group here is going to be 7 plus 1 divided by 2, which is going to be our fourth data point. And you see how that's divided it evenly again. And we can add 4 to our median to find our quartile 3, which is going to be our twelfth, which is divided it into 3 again. So our Q 1 is going to be equal to our 4th and our Q3 is going to be equal to our 12th data point. Now let's just get rid of some of this. Make some room. Okay, so what is our 12th and our 4th data point on each side going to be equal to? Well, first off, let's just write Q1 for female and Q3 for female is going to be equal to or equal to and Q1 for male and Q3 for male. So our 4th data point for males is going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, so 15. And our Q4 is uh, our Q3 rather is going to be our twelfth data point. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, which is twenty-nine. Now let's look at the female side of life. So our fourth is going to be one, two, three, four, so sixteen, and our twelfth is going to be five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, which is going to be 30. So our IQR, which we remember is quartile 3 minus quartile 1, is going to be 14 for females, and our IQR for males is going to be 29 minus 15, which is going to be 14 as well. So we have the range for both, and we have interquartile range for both. In the next video, we are going to be looking at the standard deviation for both, so I'll see you all then.